Hello once again, ladies and gentlemen. With the last few remnants of my energy for tonight, I am going to record this one final episode. For tonight, that is. I'm sure there are... I'm sure there are probably a few more before the end of this series altogether. But, uh... What am I trying to say? I am too damn tired to be doing this right now. Uh... Anyways, I think we're very close to the end now. I have a feeling after the stupid fucking water monsters. There's probably not too much more left. I could be totally wrong, though. There could be like 10 hours left, but no, I know that's not going to be the case. Oh good, there's metal bars between me and Mr. Porky over there. Hey. Get out of my way. Oh, come on. Come on. Ah, there we go. February 17th, 1899. And I said, look, my darlings, can you see it? And they said, yes, daddy, yes, we see it. A tall, weathered cap of a steel-sided pyramid so like those of Egypt. Stone falling away from the summit, vines crawling about, intertwining the stucco serpents that thrive about the steps. A palpable sense of stillness, a weight of forgotten. And this, here, this is where the king sat. And this is where the priests lived. This house, this is the house of the dead. And here, where the sun strikes, this is where they threw the hearts that were not consumed. No, my darlings, they most certainly were not savages. You see, they believed that the sky could fall on their heads, and they truly, truly believed that offering blood was the only way of stopping this from happening. Perhaps, my darling, perhaps they were mistaken altogether, or perhaps their tragedy was they could simply not spill blood enough to prevent the sky from falling in upon them. post-diluvian. That's done it! Now I can enter the strange decontamination chamber once again and move onwards. The waters are pushed back, making the way to the bilge clear, where I can divert the remainder of this filthy torrent back into the Thames where it belongs and clear the path to the center of the machine. Kinda ran out of breath there. Sorry if you caught on to that in the last few syllables. No! Go away! Go away! No! That's it, Papa. You're so near now. You shut up. You shut up. I'm watching you. Fuck you. Close that door. Come on. I forget how to work this thing. This first? Ah! There we go. Close that door. Yeah. Water monsters. <laughs> eh, they got nothing. What do I do? I forget what happens now this. There we go. That wasn't so hard. Come on. Come on. Ah, there we go. Now, do I pull that? Yeah. Please, no more water. Oh, thank God, it's dry.
No. No. Oh! That guy's... What the hell is that? That's bigger than most of them. Also kind of... No. Don't tell me I'm going down there. Oh! The hell is that? Why are they kind of bugging out and glitching a little bit? What was that? Oh, what the? Are they eating humans? Holy shit. I'm sorry, I need to get a screenshot of this. If you don't mind. What, 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 what was that? There we go. Aha, screenshot taken. Cool. Hopefully that turned out as well as I hope. Just in case, let me do that. There we go. <laughs> Oh, that is just grotesque. Must smell really nice in here. What the fuck is that? That's a weird door. Hey, what? Can I? Can I? Can I over here? Come on, the other one worked. Speaking of the other one. Clues. Clues faster. Clues better. There we go. Aha! Uh -huh. That one works. What about this one? Hey! Oh. Is it... Is that like a baby? That's depressing. It's actually really sad. I want to see more. Poor little one. It's not their fault. They didn't choose to be horrible monsters. What's this? What's in here? Well, this one doesn't look as friendly. What's it got down there? Nothing. This is sad. I never thought I'd be sad about these guys, but I am. Oh. Which way? Probably that way is where I need to go, so I'm going to stick to here for now. Oh. Oh. Seriously, this is depressing. Just to be safe. Uh, I'll leave that open a little bit so I know that's where I came from. This game is depressing me. And now I get to go down and visit Big Bertha down there. I don't wanna. It is really dark in this particular spot. Oh, what the hell? Speaking of it being dark... Okay, it's good. What is happening?
Well, I guess I'm not going there. Where's that sound? What the hell? Oh, oh, why is it stopping? Ah, oh, stop stuttering. Ugh. Ah! Ow! What the hell? I don't even have any laudanum in this one. Oh, either way it ended up the same. Was I supposed to take that much damage from that? I cannot see... There we go, that's better. How deep underground am I by now? Eh, this one looks more welcoming somehow. Come on. Climb faster. What is happening down here? If I actually have to run away from that really big one, I am not going to be a happy camper. Who? Oh. Yeah. Hmm. Where am I now? That's where I was last time. I think I'm more like down there below. Bilge pump. Maintenance access. I guess I still am down in that tube-looking area. From tide to spine, and who is it that, and and who is that third, that shadow, that spirit child in the background, that barely formed, that changeling, that almost lived, that never missed? That's cryptic. You seem to have undergone quite a profound conversion in Mexico, Mr. Manuel. You could not have seen it yourself and not, Professor. As we disembarked, even through my fever, I saw the detritus of this so-called progress. I saw starvation and disease, rot and destruction polluting the waters of the Empire. We are ruiners, you and I, and all of us, and we make the world unclean. And you took it upon yourself to act as Redeemer. Professor, I would not be so presumptuous. I am merely a conduit. I am constructing an architecture to wrestle our damnation to the ground and smother it with steam. I'll be honest, that water could look a lot better. Great looking game overall, but... Huh? More children being creepy. Same one, I'm sure, but you know what I mean. No, no. Okay. Ah! I'm here. Am I getting close to the end or what? Well, I guess I can't really go much deeper. Oh, I missed one. A nest of wretches. Dear God, a whole nest of these foul creatures. No mind, my instincts have drawn me thus far, and I am sure somewhere in this dank complex is a means of further descent. I will not see their faces as they go about their dark business, and yet... And yet I watch them sleep and eat and play, and they are so very human, so very childlike. And I will not think of what I have seen, of the chairs and the cages, and I will not think of how such monsters may be sculpted. The pump rooms. These must be the bilge pumps. I am at the heart of the saboteur's efforts. 
In order to keep his flood in place, he must have disabled these vast pumps. But he was clearly rushed. Thus far, he has left most of his work incomplete. His clumsy efforts reduced to simply switching off all he could find. If I can locate the controls, the remedy will be simple. What was that? No! I thought I was away from these! Ugh! I despise water enemies so much! Ugh. Ahead, the trickle to still waters. I drag myself deeper into the temple. Downward, and Towards a wind that held the voices of my children. Beckoning me to set them free. I know I said this was just going to be a quick episode, but considering how awesome things are getting, I might, I might have lied. <laughs> I don't really want to, I don't really want to stop playing, except when that happens. Hmm, that looks kind of important. Except apparently not, because I can't do a damn thing with it. Auxiliary pump controls. Stop. Ensure all wheels are in place for correct operation of pumps. Can I get through? I can get through. Aha, aha, nope. Can't go there. Hmm. Well, this is where my dear child just burst into a bloody f cloud of blood and death. What's happening now? What is... You... You bastard. I guess I go down? I don't know. Oh good. Valves and pipes. Another pump. It seems once again I must engage it. I cannot help but feel I am trapped in some great game, <laughs> forced to undertake endless Herculean labors for the promised reward of my darling children. That is not a very nice looking texture for a 2013 game. I'm sorry, I don't know why I keep nitpicking about this game. It looks great overall. And I love it. But... No! No, no, no! No, 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 no! no. There 
Which way? Let me check over here real quick first. Uh. first. My mistake. Oh, what's this? Main pump controls. That sounds important. Uh, excuse me, please. Is it going to work now? What the hell? Oh, oh, okay. Oh. I heard something over here. Nope. Well, that makes sense at least. Aha! down here not really to be entirely honest with you but I suppose I have to in the next episode <laughs> so I'm tired and oh, oh okay oh, there's a ladder here that actually makes things a lot less intimidating Oh, no, oh, never mind. Still pretty bad. So, yep, this is terrible. Why did I do this? What is wrong with me? When holding an object, you can click right mouse to throw the object. Yes, I know that. What am I supposed to... Oh. What am I throwing it at? Ladder? Yeah. What was the point of coming down here? Just for it to tell me a few, several hours into the game how to throw? It seems like all I gained from that. Really? Am I missing something here? I don't know. Probably back in the tunnels with the catwalks and all that. Probably something back there I was supposed to do. Let's go take a quick look and then I'm calling it quits. I need sleep. Why does it look extra grainy? Something bad is going to happen, isn't it? Oh, yeah. This isn't good. Finding the children. 
the flood is drained. I have prevailed. The saboteur is beaten. My heart pounds with excitement even as my head spins and shudders in feverish anticipation. How this machine now throbs about me, sensing its rebirth is imminent. The final descent beckons me to enter as Lily once lay on our wedding bed and summoned me into manhood. <laughs> That's a nice uh, way of putting it. Alright. What the? Oh. I don't remember where the ladder to get down was. Not over there was a la- oh yeah, there it is. <laughs> okay. And I think that'll be it for now. Stay tuned for the next part in which we begin our final dark descent. That was a horrible joke, but anyways, good night everyone. I hope you have a pleasant tomorrow. That was also pretty cheesy and terrible, but bye!